everyone. Rory asked me if she could show you guys everything that she got for Christmas. So that's what we're gonna do. We are going to show you guys everything that Rory got for Christmas, her Christmas haul. something a little differently she wants this Christmas tree I have grouped her toys to kind of the same categories and shown them all in one rather than me grabbing every single thing and showing it to you guys because that would be like a three hour long video so I have grouped it into the sections and I will show you guys and talk a little bit about them Chica you gotta cooperate okay so the first thing we have here is her group of stuff that she really needed but necessarily didn't want as a baby. We have some feeding bibs. These are covers for the Infantino carrier that I have for her. Her first little toothbrush and some toothpaste for those teethies. This is something my mom sent me that I thought was really, really cool. It is a, a drool bib, but it also holds her binky on that end there. So wear it around her neck. Her, you put her binky through there, and it's a drool bib. She got that at a craft fair I thought it was really neat she got some car seat strap covers because uh, the the belt was kind of cutting into her neck a little bit she got this bite and brush ma'am teether another little pacifier clip because that seems to be uh, pretty necessary these days with how much she pulls and tugs at things and then she got some six month binkies we had a couple but we really needed some more so grandma sent most of this stuff so that is everything that she really needed but doesn't didn't necessarily you know want well she doesn't know what she wants she's seven months old okay so here we have some puzzles rattles little teething toys books um you know just kind of really, really classic kind of thinking toys my absolute favorite thing out of this group would have to be her uh, wooden teether from Banner Toys. It is her very first vlogging camera, and I had her name engraved on it. I think this is the cutest thing I've ever seen, and it comes with um, a little leash to, to keep it on her. I love this. It means so much to us. It's a camera, you know, it, it has a lot of meaning to me and Nathan and what we do. This is also very special. It was a gift from a subscriber, Katie, this book and little plush animal set. So that means a lot to us. These are all just little simple puzzles, toys, books, you know, the smart kid toys, huh? Yeah, the smart stuff. This next little batch are little things that really mean a lot to us. This little bracelet, my sister, her Aunt Carrie, made for her. It's so special to me because my sister made me a matching one. So I have one just like that, and I think it's really, really sweet that my sister thought to make one for Rory. It's a little bit too big for her to wear right now, but she'll be able to wear it very soon. This was a gift just from her daddy to her, so this is. I thought this was really, really sweet. Excuse you, Ace. These, of course, mean so much to us. This one was from my mom, her grandma. That's from grandma. And then this was from her great grandma and my aunt. We were not able to find any baby's first Christmas ornaments here that we liked that weren't going to cost us an arm and a leg. So I was so happy when I opened these up and saw them because we looked really, really hard for one that we loved and we couldn't find it. So I was thankful to get those. And these next things are just plushes that she got. This was from my mom's best friend. My first Christmas, I this was really, really sweet. Me and Nathan got this for her. It was in her stocking. It's one of the Rudolph characters and we just thought it was super cute. There you go, my love. And this was in her stocking too. Just a little snowman wind chime. Here, you want that? Or not wind chime, just a chime. <laughs> and these are all of the toys that this spoiled little baby got. I figured I would just show you guys really quick. I would talk about a couple of them. Um, but yeah, this is... <laughs> She is very, very loved and very spoiled, and that's what she deserves, don't you? Say it was my first Christmas, Mommy. Hey, Rory. Rory. Look at Mommy. Oh, are you... Is that such a fun snowman? Oh, don't eat him! He's gonna melt! Before I move on and talk a little bit about her big stash of toys, she also received these from her Secret Santa, which I'm sure you guys saw if you watched my video, along with a million new outfits from 
my aunt and my two best friends here on the island, she and me from us and from Santa, she got a ton of clothes. I have already washed them and put them away so I can't show them to you guys. I wouldn't even be able to show that you all of them anyways. There were so many, so many outfits, but she got a ton of clothes. So I was really thankful for that. One of the things that I really, really, really wanted for her, probably more than anything else, was a little piano. I Music is huge to us. My whole family is musically inclined. Nathan's family, his dad is in a band. It just plays a huge role in both of our lives. I'm a singer and I have been my whole life, so I want Rory to love music. So we got her this little, little or my mom got her this little Tykes piano and I love it. I think it's adorable. She does love playing with it, so I love that. We went the no electronic, no battery toys route this Christmas and my family was really, really super awesome and understanding about it. She only got one electronic toy and I'm completely fine with it because it pretty much plays just music. It only has one light up button and that is this dog that her, my Aunt Pam sent her. It's so cute. It plays music. It helps her learn hand, foot, and everything. This one I was okay with and it was the only one we got. So the only part that like lights up and is flashy is this heart. So I was very much okay with her getting this and she loves it. This one is really, really neat. So I love this one. This one is just nostalgic for me and Nathan. This is like, they had these when we were little. So she got the classic pull, 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 P-U-L-L telephone that you can pull around and the eyes go crazy and it's got the phone. She loves playing with this. So this meant a lot to me because I remember playing with one when I was a kid. This I thought was really, really neat. You fill it with water and it goes on her high chair or on the floor and there's little toys in there that move around. I've never seen this before. I thought it was really neat. My mom sent it. I really, really love this. She got these awesome blocks from my friend Ashley. They're the soft buildable ones. They're, they've got pictures on them, numbers, they're awesome. She has the shape blocks to put in, the classic ring set. I found this at Carter's and I mean, it just screams her name like that. She'll play with that thing all day long. She's got some bath toys here. Uh, she really needed some bath toys. I thought this was cute, my first ducky. And then just some little, whee, just little fun toys, a snowman stacker my mom got. I got her this from TJ Maxx, I believe. Just one of those, you know, just something to play with. And that is everything that she received for Christmas. My sister made her, handmade her a beautiful blanket. Um, it's off to the side. I might be missing a couple of things, but this is the majority of what she received for Christmas. She was, we were overwhelmed with what we received from our family and so, so thankful. She had a wonderful first Christmas and it was everything that we ever thought it would be. She is fighting hard to get out of this chair. So, oh my love, one more second. One more second, okay? Okay? I am going to go ahead and end the video so I can wrangle my little baby and make her happy again. I hope you guys enjoy seeing everything that she got for Christmas. Like I said, we feel so, so blessed to have the family and friends that we do that just spoiled her rotten. If any of you have any experience or good or bad reviews on any of the stuff that you saw, please comment down below. I would love to hear your thoughts on some of the items that I got, you know, what I should look out for, if, if your kids loved them. I love everything. I probably won't get rid of it, but it's always good to know the bad sides to some, sto some, tum tum <laughs> some toys. So leave your comments down below and let me know, and we will see you guys in the next next video. Rory, you say bye to the YouTubes. Say bye YouTube. See you later. Give him a big smile. Give me a big smile. Oh, there we go. Say bye YouTubes. <laughs> hey everyone, Rory and I are here to finally do her seven month update. This is very late, but better late than never. She turned seven months on December 16th. Today is December 28th. So with the holidays and everything, crazy.